How's it going, ZFam? Welcome back to the land of Hyrule, playing some more Skyward Sword HD in episode 25. Man, what an intro. Let's just talk to Gorko. <laughs> hey. Oh, hey, bud. We meet again in a hurry as usual, eh? Yep, I've been keeping busy, too. Checking out the wonders of the world. Say, you want to hear about some of my research? Sure, man. Okay, bud. Prepare to be amazed. I made a huge discovery while I was out doing field research. Let's get a load of this. Apparently, there are walls and statues that respond to beautiful tones. Ah, oh, right, you wanna hear about? I have a harp. I have a harp. I completely forgot that I have a harp. Yeah, I do wanna hear more. Mm -hmm. All right, that's the kind of archaeological enthusiasm I like to see. Oh, well, before we get into this fan fascinating details of walls and statues, there's something I better ask you about, bud. You ever heard of a blessed butterfly? Have I seen one? Nope. Oh, right, so best of butterfly is this kind of pretty blue butterfly. You may or may not believe it. They are super hardy. They live in all kinds of places you never expect. Even a land like this, you see plenty of them. Mm -hmm. Ancient tomes mention these butterflies flapping around in packs by certain walls and statues. Seems like these butterflies have some kind of sixth sense. They're detecting something. Ah, yes, that is amazing. I like that a lot. Uh, statues. Hey. Well, the writings claim that the statues appear out of nowhere with a boy sound. In a strange language. Can you believe it, buddy? Talking statues. I know you want to hear more about this. Ooh. That's the spirit, but sadly, this is as far as my research has gotten me. As soon as I make some new discoveries, we'll be the first to know. What about the walls? <laughs> well, from what I learned, it sounds like these walls are left behind by the goddess for the hero who mentioned in the legends. The hero desires is said to spring forth from behind the walls. That's why they call them goddess walls, I suppose. Want to hear more? That's, not, that's all I know, though. Okay, six. So where is my harp? Where where is my harp? Harpu. So there's five songs. It looks like traditional instrument of Skyloft. You need to learn a song before you can play it. Okay, so that's actually insanely good to know, though. Thank you, Gorko, for the knowledge. As per usual. Okay, so what we really need is some freaking wasps. Oh crap. Got him. Right out of the air, too. But I wonder if I can catch those birds. Oh, <laughs> they heard me. They heard me, bruh. Big old rock. Dude, the bigger net. Massive. Massive. And not just in the, you know, like, big sense, but massive in, like, the good sense. So I know there was a wall into a cave right there that I could go into, but... And there's also a way that way, but there's also a way this way. Why is there so many ways I can go? What is this door? I don't remember. It's been so long since I've been here, I don't remember which way is which. You know what I mean? I know I probably could just check the map, but... You gotta be kidding me, Granny! Oh, looks like I need the right way to go. You're messing with me. Say it again. I dare you. I only speak the truth. You are not the one who will save her. The spirit maiden your Zelda can only be saved by another. It has been vain. I forgot what this lady's voice is, but this is what I'm making it. In doing so, save us, I decided to brought crying to the world. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. There's someone driving by real slow. I like having a window here, by the way. Now we have two lights. We have better lighting. We got the window here. I get the light there. <laughs> Shut it, Granny. You obviously don't know me well, because if you did, you know that anyone's going to save Zelda. It's Groose. How could it not be me? Plus, if it ain't me, why would I even be here? Pfft. I'm not the job of being who you are, just who is. No. No. Uh -uh. Oh, now I get you. Some more Granny's been trying to tell me you're going to be the big hero rescue Zelda. <laughs> what a joke. Bunch of babbling about destiny, blah, blah, blah. All right, Groose. All right, Groose. No! <sighs> Greetings. Were you able to catch up with Zelda? You mm -hmm. see, the Guardian is there as well, was she? One well, saw Zelda is known Impa. Yeah. The goddess has aided Zelda in her quest. Two have traveled somewhere in order to accomplish the great task destiny has set before them. However, now that Impa has destroyed the gate they used, there's only one way left to find them. Must make use of the hop given to you by Zelda. Yes, give me a song. 
have you attempted to play the hop? No, I didn't. I, I literally just remembered I had it, actually, like two minutes ago. Very well, I should teach you how to play it. Listen well and do as I say. Press X to ready your hop. Bam! Try strumming. Oh my god, this is going to be so hard. Dude, the motion controls just literally don't work. <laughs> they just don't work. I'm moving it, but it's not moving. Watch. I'll show you on camera. Great help for you on your Sorry, I was just reading it. There's a pulsing of voice now that I need dead. they don't make it like a really complicated song. Yo. Where's Grease? <laughs> been passed on from ancient generations so this is what i use for the butterflies so even though it shows the controller being this way i think you're actually supposed to have it this way that helped a little bit i will say oh look this made a wall up here a strange wall the hop you know old is known as the goddess's hop it's a divine instrument of the goddess who once watched over this land Melodies it brings to life have the power to produce a variety of strange and otherworldly effects. The great slab standing before you is known as the Gate of Time. It is the last of its kind in existence. The only portal binding our world to the one where yours dwells and now resides. Well, hopefully we don't destroy it. If you manage to open this gate and pass through, you will likely end up in the same place as Zelda. But you need to endure many hardships and put yourself in great danger to awaken the gate from its dormant state. Though so your journey will put you in harm's way. Must endure. Is your fate as the chosen hero of the gut? <laughs> like I said, hopefully he doesn't get destroyed. I'm shaking. I fear the seal has been broken. I expected it would redact you to summon the gate. I never imagined the seal would break so quickly. There will be time to explain later. Right now you must hurry to the bottom of the pit outside. Where's the pit? I forget where the pit is. Is it this way? Yes, open that gate. So wait, I remember in the pit, there was that thing. Bruce is out here crying. What's with all the shaking? The whole crowd is even. I thought it was supposed to be solid down here. Through. Wow, I love how her braid is still ticking perfectly. Check to see a spike in the center of the pit. There is nothing nature about these tremors. That monster could free itself at any moment. Approach the pit with caution. Oh, that's right. We're killing the, the big fishy boy, El Lago. Ugh. 
the obelisk. Oh boy, he's up. So wait, I'm like right next to him. Probably not for the best. Ooh. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho. He has a link. I don't know about this one, Chief. Be it risen. I'm sorry, what? Oh, he's got feet. Wow. I knew it. The shield is given way. I'll explain later. It just, it must not reach the temple. Oh, really, huh? Okay, well, this is gonna be hard. to run back. Let's go. I knew that I like that link ran to the front. That was cool. Let's get a blow on him. into his skull. It's all red now. Wait, what? I don't know what I'm gonna do here. Oh, he's back. I was gonna bomb roll down into his mouth, dude. But his toe's gonna grow back too? God, that's weird. <laughs> I wonder if a bomb will do good, actually. Let's try it out. I shouldn't have ran that far out, but. I don't know if they want you to use those, but we'd be using them. Let's go. Sword, all right, motion controls have been good this fight. They've been good this fight. Get out of here with that. Oh, the bomb just blew up. <laughs> I was hoping I timed it perfectly. after this step. Oh, no. Crap.
Do I have a thing to run out of the front? I don't think I do. I think I just have to run. Can I run around the right? I don't know if I can. I'm not going to risk it. Oh, motion controls almost effed me there, dude. It almost effed me. Oh, that was a cool boss fight. It wasn't that, like, difficult to not die, but the timer of it was really good. That's what made it hard. That was a good boss fight. That was a really good boss fight. I thought that was supposed to be, like, the last boss. Clearly something's going on here. I think we just sealed him a little bit more. That's all that happened. Whoa. And Zelda always gets trippy, don't it? Yeah, we just sealed him again, I think. Resealed. Now, mm. Zamor. Strike it with the Skyward Strike and restore the seal quickly. Quickly? triangle <laughs> took me a second but I got it I got him oh perfect timing link good job very celebratory we sealed him. All right, now he's ready for the next Zelda game. <laughs> Man, I look like a badass. Nice going, Zamor. Though the imprisoned had only just begun to awaken and break his bonds, I'm impressed you were able to restore the seal of keeping you captive. Fortunately, you have only succeeded in buying us a little more time. The behemoth you beat back into confinement is a horror of unspeakable power. Judging by what I saw, I would not be surprised if the seal gave way again soon. We are left with precious little time to complete the task with which you have been entrusted. Turn to the sealed temple. Man, your hat is so tall. And it is just so pointy. It is almost on the top of the screen. There is much to discuss. Enough about my hat. This is like... This is what info becomes, basically. <laughs> Alright, Grease is starting to realize that. Wait a second. <laughs> we're, we, we're, we're adults now. As you can see, the gate is nothing more than a slab of cold stone for now. Sleeping, rousing it from its slumber world would require great power. Remember, never mind. Yes, I believe a shot of holy light from your scarlet strike might just do it. That's it? Sorry to disappoint you, boy, but your sword lacks power for the necessary to awaken the gate. Your sword and you must grow together. I need to upgrade my sword? Hell yeah! Ferret Woods, Elder Volcano, and Leneru Desert. Sacred flame is hidden somewhere in each of these lands. Seek them out and purify your sword in their heat. That is dope. Let's go. Once your blade is tempered by these three fires, it will be fully imbued with a great power in which you seek. <laughs> Clues to finding the sacred flames would have been woven into the lyrics of this song by your precious of your people. Blah, 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 blah. The ballad of the goddess. These clues are your best hope of finding your way to the flames. Turn to Skyloft, somewhere in your island. There's someone whose knowledge of this old song will point you in the right direction. It's gonna be the uh, mayor, right? The old guy? The old cheeky guy. Not Zelda, is it? What the hell do you want, man? Why are you still following me around? Go back to home. Go back home, kid. Yeah. 
Don't even say anything. God dang it. <laughs> I hate even saying this, but I guess you got it all figured out, Grady. Me? Well, there's nothing I can do to help stop that. I'm useless. Sell yourself short, my friend. You'll see in time that you have your own role to play in all of this. That's the first humble thing he's ever said, bro. Don't, don't, don't take it away from him. All right. No more go now. Trust in your fate to guide your feet. Your mission depends on it, as does Zelda's fate. Dang. Big mission with Granny here. What's her name? The Old One. When the three sacred flames have imbued your soul, the clue that will lead you to the flames woven in your song is the Ballad of the Goddess. Return to Skyloft! You fool! And the 3D symbol's pretty cool. And this thing be looking a bit... Be looking a bit... I love Zelda. <laughs> Such a good game. Let's save. Alright, Fee wants to talk to me. Because last time you gave me good information, we'll talk to you. The Ballad of the Goddess. Based on my projection, it is likely the song... Yeah, duh. Okay. Friggin' duh, dude. Now, we, next time you want to talk, we're not going to let you talk. Only when you give good information do we allow you to speak. Alright? Just how it works. I don't make the rules, man. Two fairies is actually huge. It's actually pretty big. Although they only restore up to six hearts. So maybe later, once we have a lot of hearts, um, it would actually probably be better to have that thing that gives us extra hearts. You know what I'm saying? Instead of the, uh... Brother. Come here. Alright, whatever. You know what? Me too, Link. What is this? Dig. Whatever. She looks so ridiculous, dude. So I kind of want to go out and find a little, a little beehive real quick. I think that's what we're gonna do, because I do really want to upgrade the um, slingshot. Or what is it, the slingshot? It's something. I want to upgrade the something that I desire to upgrade. Might have been the seed pouch actually, which would also be useful, because I think it's necessary to have a seed pouch as well. <clears throat> I mean, there's these fruits up there, but those aren't. Great Goron, have I found some? <gasps> Look at those butterflies rest on the beautiful tones swarming all over this place. This has to be the right spot. Mm -hmm. Could be a problem. I cannot carry a tune. Cannot create beautiful tones. Wild animals threaten me to roll down a hill. <laughs> what can we do? All right, so I go up to the butterflies. And I go to my pouch. Ah, you just push X. Wow, that's all I gotta do. Hey, it's one of these guys. I thought it would be. That is it! One of the talking statues of ancient There's no mistaking it! Ooh, an ornamental skull. Fog. Butterflies tend to gather around gossip stones like myself. If you find a spot swarming with butterflies, play a tune of great beauty, and a gossip stone might just pop out of the ground with a boy. Butterfly. Oh, that's his. That's his. That's his hint. His hint is that they exist. Well, that's huge. All right. Well, let me go up here and see if this leads into the Farron Woods, where I might be able to find. Uh, Oh, this just leads to the top of this. But the Farron Woods is literally like right here, right? It's not the bottom. It's like up here, isn't it? What the hell's wrong with you? Oh, come on. I couldn't do a thing. I'm totally useless. Yeah. I'll... You know, don't be too hard on yourself. But yeah, you were pretty useless back there. I won't lie. How do I get this other one? Just gotta wait for him to come down. Okay. 
It's because Groose over there was hitting the goddamn wall. If Groose wasn't hitting the wall, I would have been able to get him. Where can I go? Can I go all the way around this? Have I been over here before? I mean, I, it looks like there is some stuff over there. I don't know what possibly could be over here, but I want to go over here now. <laughs> I'm pretty sure all of this has already been explored by me like a year ago when I first started playing this game. Back then, I used to live stream it. You guys remember that? If anyone, if anyone's there from those days, I'm sure, I'll probably get new viewers doing this too. Wait, what? It's just a dead end. Are you freaking kidding me? Well, you know, at least we got to see Groose. Kind of cool, right? I wonder what would have happened if he would have got to the temple. I mean, game over for sure, but like what? You know? So what that means is that in the original location that I needed to go, or that I started at over here with Gorko, I just needed to go to the left. Let's find this freaking beehive before we end this goddamn episode. Am I right, guys? Because I just want to get... I want to get the beehive. It'll be important, I feel like. What do you think of the statue? Just like the old text say, buddy. I heard the boy oiling and it's broken a strange tongue. It was a major leap forward in all the study of talking statues. Except the goddess walls. I got an inkling. I don't have to look very far for those either. I mean, to find one, no matter what. I bet there's one, like, over here. Like, actually, real talk. If I made these shortcuts... I think so we should be good, right? What is this? Oh, I'm gonna accidentally put that down. Here we go, Farron Woods. Alright. Cool. Take a shortcut. I don't know if this matters, but. So this is how you get these, but these guys don't have, like, beehives, right? Or honey, right? I think I just need to be hitting, like, every single tree, man. This is definitely where you get these. I only ever remember seeing one, though. You know what I mean? I only ever remember seeing one beehive, ever. I think I might just explore around. I'll cut back to you uh, if we find anything. God dang it. Interesting. But I don't think we will, I'll be honest. No, I don't it. I wonder what this is. Door sealed shut. I'm gonna need like a water tune, I bet, to get through there. Some description. You know what I'm saying? What the heck do you want, man? Heck out of my way. The big guy's not here anymore. Oh, he is. Bomb wall there. Maybe I can go like right. Maybe has this guy got a freaking. Did I heard a. Did he? That's just nuts. Oh, that was a beetle. Alright, let's go up here. I don't know if I've been here or not. Probably have, but the bomb wall here. Maybe I haven't. Nice. Chest. Okay. I mean, that's something. But I've already been walking around for like six, seven minutes, guys. 
There's a lot of stuff you need the hook shot for. A little feather. It's probably just gonna be stuff like that too for all these like collectible things. But I, there is like goddess cubes and stuff. I guess I do have the beetle now. Let's, let's see what's going on up here. That's what it's for. It's for upgrading the beetle. Dang. Okay, yeah, I really do want it. Make the beetle go faster. Huge. All right. All right. I wonder where you start this. There's like a cave up here. This has to be like after like post hook shot or something. And it's like the next place to go or something. You know what I mean? I don't think I have any way to get up there at all. <laughs> yeah, that one, there's a hook shot like right next to it. See it right there? Oh, there's the guy over there to talk to, too. I guess I can go talk to him. And then there's down here you can get in. They don't want you to swim here, do they? Let me lie. Come on, please. Please. Thank you. It'll just be so much easier. Let's talk to our little Pui Pui guy here. Oh, they're here. You may not have noticed, but I'm trying to hide here. See, boy. This is where we, uh, fought all of them. It hit me in the head. Give me a friggin'. I see that you didn't find the girl in the deep woods, Kui Pali. But you can't lose heart, just as I've reunited my fellow Kikwis. No, I'm the one who reunited with y'all. All right, you didn't do it. I did it. It was. Me. I don't even know if I want to claim that though. Claim that or fame. Oh, look at this. You need a bomb to get in here. I think this is gonna be the legitimately the last thing I explore. I've been walking around for ten minutes now. I was just trying to find a. A friggin' uh, beehive. But, um, alas, if there is one, I could not find it. Could not find it. Fari. Fortunately, I do not need you, Mr. Fari. This just leads me to the, um, the Kikwi place. Those little sticky bomb things are cool. It was a good idea. Anyway, um, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. If you did enjoy it, please drop a like. It does help me out. But most of all, thank you for your view. That helps me out the most. Um, hope you enjoyed. This has been episode 25 of the Legend of Zelda Breath of... 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 Breath of...